Welcome back. This is Mr. Hassan's Mass Channel, and I'm now answering question number eight from the specimen paper for the IGCSE um, paper two non calculator. This is Cambridge 0580. This is um, the new uh, papers which will be started from 2025. Now we're given this question which shows a semicircle with diameter nine centimeters we've got to calculate the total perimeter of this semicircle giving your answer in exact form which of course would be what's sensible when you don't have a calculator all right so now um this is one of those topics where the formula sheet the new formula sheet that you have now now before there, there wasn't a formula sheet really in the old syllabus any formula you need they'd give you the question um, and they wouldn't give formally for, for example, circles and, um, you know, the like. So in, in this question, we're asked to find the total perimeter of the circle. So the perimeter of the circle, first of all, means the length of the outline of the circle. That's what perimeter means. So if we consider this, it's basically the length of this curved part, which is like that part. And then you have to add the length of this, this straight line here. Okay, so that's what we'll find. That's what the perimeter is. So the perimeter here is going to be the length of this arc, which is going all the way around from there to there, plus you got here the diameter. You could say the diameter. Okay, so that's how you find the perimeter of this shape. Now the length of the arc is basically a part, a half of the circumference of a circle. Now the circumference of the circle you have two formula you can use 2 pi r which is the one the formula sheet gives you and another one you could use is pi d which is because the radius um, or you can say the, the the two times the radius is the diameter right so pi times d is the circumference of the circle now because we have half a circle then the perimeter would be given by um, pi d divided by 2 and then you have to add the diameter that's pi d divided by 2 plus the diameter and that will give us the perimeter of this semicircle okay so what we're going to do now is we're going to say okay the perimeter is equal to pi times 9 over 2 plus 9 okay and 9 over 2 is 4.5 I mean, we could leave it like this we could say 9 over 2 pi plus 9 we could put 4.5 pi plus 9 both of them are fine I think I'll, I'll stick to 9 pi over 2 plus 9 okay that's the answer in exact form that's the perimeter of this um, semicircle all right so that's the answer to part a uh, pretty simple okay and as I said if you go back to the formula sheet here you can see they tell us the circumference of the circle is 2 pi r so you could use that if you forget the formula so that's one thing that's one of the advantages of this new syllabus a lot of these formulae here were not given before and now they are things like the quadratic formula and the sine rule cosine rule and so on um, so there's a few um, advantages now in this new syllabus and that's one of them so there's the answer to this question number eight other questions from this particular paper can be found in the playlist that will appear in the top right corner of the screen at the end of the video other questions that are dealing with this topic of um, basically this is going to be under menstruation um, I'll t there's going to be uh, there's a playlist especially about circles so I'll put it in, in that playlist there and you can also um, see the questions I've got from the previous uh, syllabus dealing with this whole topic of circles um, and you can s subscribe to the channel by clicking on the link up there thank you for watching see you soon